Hey guys, um, today I'm going to be showing you how to make a really cool border for your video. Um, for, um, your, there's a couple programs you will need. You will need Adobe Fireworks CS4 and Sony Vegas Pro 9 or 10. Alright, so when you open up this, you're going to first of all make it um, 1280 times or by 720. Um, it's going to be transparent, and yeah, that's just about it. Alright, so you're going to click this tool right here, pen tool, and you're just going to draw an outline. So, draw a border, just like so. Alright. Alright, so here's my border. Um, I'm gonna make it blue. Um, granite, linear, and. Black and white. You guys can make this any color you please. I just chose to do this because I prefer it. So, uh, blue. Alright. Okay, so there's what's going to be on your thing. And now you're going to want to add text. You're going to take the text tool right here. And you're going to line it like so. Alright, so I'm going to put my YouTube channel. Uh, God. I'm going to type in my YouTube channel. Alright, and I'm just going to adjust the font because it's too big. Uh, Alright, and now I'm just going to adjust the color. Because I can. Remember, guys, this is completely your border. You can do whatever you want with it. So, alright, that looks pretty good. Um, you can also take like what you want, and you can add in uh, your own pictures. I'm gonna go ahead and add in my own avatar from my Xbox Live. Uh, alright, I can just keep them there, just because it looks pretty cool. And I'll just have your avatar there. Um, yeah. So uh, basically, what you're gonna want to do is, sorry, what you want to do is, you're gonna want to go up to here and you're gonna click save. I just come up and you can just type in border for YouTube. Okay. So that's my border. Alright, you can minimize this, and you're going to go into here. Alright, now you're going to get a clip. Okay, import media. Uh, where is it? Alright, um, videos. Uh, sorry guys. Here. Why can't I find it? Alright. Here. And just find a random clip. Alright, so, got it. And you just put it down on the timeline. Okay. So, um. Here's mine. And you're gonna drop it down. Oh. Alright, then you're gonna go to import media and you're gonna find order for YouTube alright
Alright, it's right here. Alright, now you're going to take it and you're going to put it above all your clips. And you'll see that it comes up right there on the bottom. And, uh, you can play the clip. It'll show up. Like so. Alright, just so if anybody tried to steal your clips, you can always just put that on the bottom. Just to like clarify that it is yours and you don't want anybody taking it. So Yep, that is my tutorial on how to get a YouTube banner. Um I will be putting up another tutorial on how to get some um, like a really good color correction on either a Dazzle or an HD PVR for uh on Sony Vegas. Alright, thanks guys. Peace. Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to get a really good color correction for um, Modern Warfare 2 and Call of Duty 4. Alright, so what you want to do is you're going to go to File, Import, Media, and you're going to have a clip. Um, you're just going to import a clip. I already have mine here, so you just drag it down onto the timeline. And um, what you want to do is you're going to go to Video Effects and Brightness and Contrast and because I already have a preset I'll just let you guys copy those you can pause the video um, and they will all be in the description also alright so that's those okay and now you're gonna go down all the way to saturation adjust um, first I'm gonna show you my best color correction and uh, that is all the other stuff uh, for my uh, saturation adjust. So um, remember, this is all going to be in the description, so don't panic. Yeah, if you don't get it down. All right, and now you're going to go to sharpen, reset to none, drag it down and don't even worry about moving it or adjusting it you can just close it out alright now you're going to go to self contrast or soft sorry and remember to say presets it just helps you out a lot alright so you're just gonna save like get these three down they're probably all the same anyway but just copy those down alright and then you're gonna go to uh, vinted something. Then you're gonna change exterior effect to blur. Alright. Now you're gonna make these two five. Okay. And you're gonna make that should be rectangle. Um. Yep. And here's that all right now when you go back to the clip it's just a really nice like effect if you ask me like it's just really cool I uh, find I also have another color correction all right um, effects take all these off Okay, now I'm gonna try again my other form of this. So I'm gonna get these two down. Stretch range zero, diffusion 9.82, uh, contrast 100, blur, uh, strength 60, horizontal blur 5. This 5, 24.73, 80, 80, and then the rest will stay the same. Okay. Now you're going to go to sharpen, same as before. Drag it on. Don't even worry. Alright, saturation adjust. And you're going to get these. Alright, this is going to be 1, full, uh, 2740. Spread five three 
five hundred and whatever. Uh, low one, high nine zero eight zero. Okay. Now you're gonna go all the way up to brightness and contrast. Go down, and I just use the same for all. So my COD four. Uh, yeah, you can just keep these settings. Okay. And uh, as you see, it got uh, like brighter, and it just looks a bit better with the blur and the brightness. All right, that's my color correction tutorial. Uh, I hope this helped you guys, and um, yeah, just I'm looking forward to seeing all your comments on if this helped or not, and if it's a good color correction. Um, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Bye.